We would like to start our presentation with honor to our fathers. We have our spiritual father, we have our spiritual mother, we have Apostle Tov and his wife. And I would ask us first to start with honoring our other spiritual parents. We honor them and we honor Pastor Sunday. We value you. Thank you that we have you. And flowers, please. Zhenya, please help with flowers. Thank God. These are the flowers for the wife of Apostle Dov. Because it is always like this that near the strong man there is a strong great woman. We love you, we honor you, we value. And I would like to start our presentation with the scripture. We know Matthew chapter 25 starting with verse 33. He will put the sheep on his right and the goats on his left. Then the king will say to those on his right, come you who are blessed by my father Take your inheritance, the kingdom prepared for you since the creation of the world. For I was hungry, and you gave me sometimes something to eat. I was thirsty, and you gave me something to drink. I was a stranger, and you invited me in. I need clothes, and you clothed me. I was sick, and you looked after me. I was in prison, and you came to visit me. Then the righteous will answer him, Lord, when did we see you hungry and feed you, or thirsty and give you something to drink? When did we see you a stranger and invite you in, or needing clothes and clothe you? When did we see you sick or in prison and go to visit you? The king will reply, I tell you the truth, whatever you did for one of the least of these brothers of mine, you did for me. And on the basis of this scripture, we are standing today here on this stage because this scripture was as our basis and we took this scripture and God Embassy Church is moving forward in social direction. We are happy to inform you today that social direction is the pri one of the first priorities in God Embassy Churches. I would like to say today and emphasize that social direction is very important today. It's historical and social direction it's urgent for our generation and for the time in which we live. Yesterday, when we started our conference, we heard from our bishop that the influence of God Embassy churches spreads onto more than 10, among more than 10 million people. And I would like to say that we can cover this number of people thanks to social activities of our churches. Our church is a missionary church. Our vision is to build a strong and great church and also to send missionaries into all the countries of the world. And God is sending us into Arabian countries, into China, and God gives us the keys of kingdom and the keys that God gives us today, these are the keys of uh, to social ministries. Through social ministries, we will be able to take China. With the help of social ministries, we will be able to take Arab countries and turn hearts of these people to God. For our churches, 
one of the first priorities is to prepare and to educate highly qualified ministers for the work with difference in different spheres of the society. In other words, I would like to say that for us, it is very important for us to prepare Christian social workers. And the scripture that we have just read shows us that God will judge people according to their social activities. God says that I was hungry, I was thirsty, I need it. And according to our reaction on social activities, a lot depends in our life and what will be with us depends on our social activities. Church, I would like to remind you that God calls us to serve in social, so, serve socially in prisons, in uh, children's houses, in schools, and to serve for those people who need our help. I would like to tell you today that homeless people, poor people, not protected people, left by society, people, these people are very valuable for church. It's a great treasure for our church. And coming to the end of my presentation, I would like to say that the main principle of the modern social politics and the principle of social activities is to value personalities not depending on their physical and spiritual condition, not depending on what religion the personality has. God sends us into society and we are so happy that in God Embassy Church we are so strong and confident in this direction. There are ma very many social directions in our church and of course we will not be able to tell you about everything that we have. And I would like to ask to change the names of our directions on the screen. And it's a great honor for me to present you Pastor Nikolai Narsesevich. This is the person who is older than 70 years old. He inspires me all the time. And he moves in the direction of social movement, which is called healing movement. He works with ill people. So the word for you, Pastor. Good evening, dear church. I'm glad to see each of you at this hall. Our healing ministry was, uh, was created in 1995. For 16 years, the healing ministry helped 119,000 uh, 119, people who were ill. There were people who came to the to services, people who were in uh, in the hospitals, people who were at homes, and our ministers went there and they were praying for them. During this period of time, 22,000 people uh, repented. More than 22,000 people repented. During 2010, the healing ministry helped 4,670 people and brought to repentance 1,260 people. During three months of this year, the healing ministry helped 1,255 people and brought to repentance 330 people. These are fruits of my brothers and sisters who help also those people who are ill, who have uh, AIDS, who have cancer. Our possibilities are great because God is always moving before us. 
And I also want to add that in each hospital, there is a person who is responsible. I want to say that uh, we created social organizations through which we help people who are ill at homes, uh, in the hospitals. Also, uh, there is a consultation uh, m committee uh, that works in hospitals. and. Uh, let uh, your minister uh, let us greet ministers thank you very much good evening dear church hallelujah be blessed be healthy and we wish you a lot of love we are ukrainian christian uh, choir that is that is called revival and we want to sing a song we congratulate you. We congratulate you in Ukraine. Where the land is re is in revival. And our brothers and sisters will meet you or, uh, in joy, and they will serve you as a family. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you. I want to underline that this ministry, mostly there are people, uh, the elderly people. Even those people, even these people are fruitful and they are strong. We love you and we bless you. And the healing ministry is everywhere in all the uh, churches, uh, uh, in all the daughter churches. And even if there isn't such, uh, even if there isn't such a ministry, they have such a task to open such ministry. It is our goal. It is where we are moving to. Next movement of a social direction is is a trust line. A trust line, and is there someone? Okay, Tamara. Hello, church. I congratulate you on this anniversary happy birthday my name is tamara i'm the head of a trust line a trust line started it, its work on the 1st of march in 1999 and there are eight directions it is the prayer direction the advertising direction working with uh, born again uh, it is a computer direction. We have uh, the statistics. So we count each person who d uh, who uh, asked us to help. And um, during this year, twelve thousand, uh, uh, more than twelve thousand people called us. 
and 28,000 people who are not believers. 9,151 people repented. Our ministry gives a psychological help to those who are in critical positions, who are, who are in stress situations. And people call us, for, uh, people of different state and position call us. People from uh, America, Ukraine, Spain, the US, Belarus, and all other different uh, countries call us. In 12 years, we have an experience of consultating of more than 40 problems. It is homeless people. Uh, it is uh, uh, the uh, relations before marriage, uh, the uh, rapes, uh, differ divorces, uh, different kinds of addiction, fear, death of uh, of the closest people, family issues, and a lot of a lot of other questions and problems. Also, we have a school at the trust line that works in two movements. This school was opened in 2010 in autumn, and the first uh, level is to prepare the consultants and volunteers who will work in, in the trust line. And the second level is to prepare the consultants who will be professionals and who will help in different uh, kinds of problems. Thank you, Tamara. And I want to remind you, dear church, that the trust line should work in all the uh, in all the daughter churches in all the region uh, regions. And if you don't have if you don't have uh, the trust line, please write it as a task. You can call to the trust line, and we will help you. We'll support you in this for you to have the same direction, to have the same movement in all the regions of the Embassy of God Church. And the third movement <coughs> of a social work is a great ministry in prison. It is a chaplain's ministry. And I want to, to present you Pastor Konstantin Datsik. A word for you. Good evening, church. Happy birthday. Listen, in Isaiah 53, 12, it is written that he started to pray for, uh, he started to pray for killers. He's asking God for those who are killers, for those who are thieves. And this ministry uh, works in more than 60 uh, prisons that are on the territory of Ukraine, uh, Belarus, and in Europe. Uh, these are men's and women's prisons, prisons for teenagers. Chaplains, uh, together with uh, the government of Ukraine and uh, the uh, Department of, uh, of Fulfilling the, uh, uh, the Punishment, and also with the social organizations, sport uh, without drugs, and other different organizations that take part in this movement, influence uh, on more than 15,000 people who, who regularly attend uh, our mean our services, who uh, who study at the uh, University of Restoration the uh, Personality, and also we opened the courses uh, of uh, compute of uh, improving computer skills. We buy computers and uh, we improve their skills to work on computers. And also we have family trainings. Uh, we write letters with those people who are in prison. And we all, all the time we conduct different football matches. And during uh, 2010, we conducted more than uh, 40 matches. And we believe that each person has right for salvation and for changing their lives. It is just a, a question of time. And our task is to go, to move, and to do his, uh, uh, his tasks. And I want to invite everyone to cooperate, everyone who has this on, uh, on their hearts, everyone who wants to help. And if you have prisons in your regions, I invite you to cooperate. And my contact uh, info. Uh, is in a trust line. You can call them, and you can get my, uh, my contact information. 
and also you work with those who are in prison, you work with uh, uh, different organizations, and I guess that you're planning to work with relatives, right? Yes, we, uh, we work with families. We have Alexandra who can give a testimony about this uh, ministry. Hello, church. My name is Alexander. Periodically during 10 years, I was doing drugs. Um, I came uh, I came to God for several times, but I fell. Uh, and the last time I, uh, I, uh, I missed uh, the, uh, uh, the drug and I, uh, and I, uh, I hardly uh, died, you know. But the uh, pastors came to the prison and they were praying for me. I, I had, uh, uh, I was in prison for four times and I was in different prisons. And the last time I was in prison uh, for three years. Uh, but they, uh, they let me go and they said that for two years I was leaving uh, now I got married I have a great wife and during th that two years I finished the uh, Joshua Bible School and uh, in uh, after two days uh, in two days after I finished this uh, school they called me to prison again and in prison uh, and in prison I serve that people and now we have families that are restored their wives came back to them. There are people uh, who are going through rehabilitation center. Now I'm the member of a social organization and I'm a head of a department uh, of a social organization. And there are a lot of such people in our church, people who repented in prison or or maybe they uh, uh, repented in freedom, but they were uh, put in prison because of their, uh, of their late deeds. And we work there, we work in prisons, because even that people who are in prison are our treasure. Thank you very much. And the next direction for us, the next direction, we also work with invalids. And I would like to invite Pastor Pyotr Guznitsky, the word is for you, please. I'm so happy that the topic of the conference is to spread the kingdom of God among people. And one of the people are invalids. If to take the world, these are 500 millions of people. So if to take, for example, we are here for thousand people here so we have to put 400 vehicles for 400 chairs for disabled and thanks to this church this direction was born and for today mostly this social direction works in houses where these disabled people live and these are those people who accepted Jesus these are mostly people who are paralyzed who use chairs to move because they can't walk but thanks to our ministry they raise their life is changed because they listen to audio discs to video discs they listen to preachings and their lives are changed of course government doesn't care too much about these people about this category of people and uh, we have rented the house it will be like a sanatorium for such house because government doesn't uh, care about these people so we decided to take responsibility and for today 73 people work with us and these were people who were not needed by their relatives but now they work with us they s help us to buy some new equipment for disabled and they are happy that they can help nowadays so if you would like to serve in our direction please call trust line and we will give you telephone numbers. Church, don't forget, please, that the main principle of our social work is the honor of every personality, not depending on his physical or psychological health, not depending on his age, 
on his sex, on his religion, on social direction. So on the basis of this principle, we work with disabled people. And continuing this topic, I would like to give the word the word to Yulia. She also works with the disabled, but with children, disabled children. Thank you very much. Good evening, church. I would like to present the social organization, the help to close people. We have several directions. This is family direction. We work with the problem uh, with the families who have problems. We also work with youth. We also work with veterans in our region. And also we work with alcohol and drug addicted people. I would like to present to you our princess who is in our church. She has come to church through charitable concert, which was organized in our region. And uh, this person, she can sing. She also writes poems. And she's a very active member of our church. And also, she is a member of worshiping team in our church. So please greet this person. Good evening, church. I would like to say that when I was said that I have to come to the stage as a representative of the club Harmony, for first, for me, it was not very pleasant because I felt my I felt like an like a disabled person because before I didn't think about myself like a disabled person. I always try to fulfill myself and I want to be even better than other people. But then I was sitting, sitting and thinking that it's the fact that I was thinking about that it's because of my pride and it's not from God. So I don't want to be a person who needs help, but the person who can and wants to help other people. And I realize that if I will be on this stage and if I testify, if people see me, it will be a help to someone. At least for one person, it will be a help. So I would like to say that those people who are maybe disappointed in their lives, you have to trust in yourself and to live with God. Thank you very much. Thank you. Through our directions, God gives hope. And with the help of this social organization, we prove that no matter what condition does the person have, the most important person, the most important thing is to have God in the soul. I have an honor to invite Pastor Lesa, and she will present the next direction, direction of work with homeless people. Good evening, dear church. I congratulate you one more time on this great holiday. You know, today we present the direction of work with homeless people. And you know, this is the movement. This is a work with people who don't have houses. These are people who are rejected by society, who are not protected by government, by people at all. And I would like to say that if we, as a church, will not deal with these people, will not care about these people, no one will care about them. Neither society nor other people will not care about these people because they are homeless. But we made decision that we will change the thinking of the society concerning these people. And for today, we fed more than 10,000 people. If to investigate our region, our city, you know, in we have a city with a population of uh, 7,000 people. And we can you imagine, so the number that we've fed, it means that we've fed almost the whole but except for feeding for 
this, we also give medical help. We also help to find relatives. And also, we work spiritually and morally with these people. And they know God better. They know Jesus Christ through our direction. Good evening. I would like to present the club for families with many children, which is called Pearl. More than 100, 1,500 families addressed into our organization. These are families who have five, six, and more children. The program of club is various and bright. We organize actions, theme meetings. We invite clowns like these. So please greet our clowns and every action every charitable action that we organize is organized in such a way that we bring people to god and people you know are changed they become kind these families they ch can feel changes in their lives the children of these families they feel care these families they got finances spiritual help material help every person can find place in our direction so thank you very much i would like to add then when lesa told that they fed 10000 people when they said that they fed 10,000 people, it's in your city. But if to take the whole God Embassy churches for eight years in Stefania dining room, we fed more than 8 million people for 10 years. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. The next direction, it may seem not social to you, but in reality, we think that this is a social direction. Why? Because we live in society. And all kinds of works that we do in society, they are social. And uh, even when we invite people and when we tell people about Jesus, I think that this is a social work. When we heal souls of people, when we give them what they need most of all, spiritual spiritual understanding, spiritual knowledge. So I have an honor to invite Yelena Shevchenko, who will introduce social direction, which is called uh, uh, Festival of Jesus. Thank you very much. Good evening, church. Good evening, guests. I'm happy to greet you. In 2008, the Festival of Jesus movement was born. The Festival of Jesus these are demonstrations of miracles of God. The main topic is, the main idea is to save souls of people through the preachings of the word of God. And the festivals that are organized in different cities show that they are very important for people and in one of the towns more than 300 people were saved people saw us as an answer of our of their needs and uh, when we first organized th uh, this festival in Gribinki town we understand and we understood that we have to continue working in other towns so we started to organize these festivals in uh, many many cities there were different cases when we prayed about ill people and there was no case when we prayed about the person and the person was not healed so everyone was healed when we prayed for them so during this short period of time we realized and according to statistics we can see that more than 3000 people repented more than 200 people came through rehabilitation and we we are so happy to see that through this festival of Jesus we can see that the word of God is fulfilled the word which speaks that the harvest is ready and uh, for me near me there is an assistant my assistant who 
has helped us since November. She made covenant with God. She attends home groups, churches, and she helps us. This is one of the fruit of Kiev City. Church, I suggest you a classical a classical way, you know, to spread the word of God everywhere. The next direction is the work with children from families, from critical pro families. So I present to you the International Fund, the Embassy of Love, uh, Life. Good evening, dear church. Our fund, your name is Vladimir. Yeah. Vladimir, tell us, please, that you are, that you yourself is a fruit of this. Our fund deals with children who are in critical situation who are in crisis and one of our direction is to work with homeless children since the beginning more than 72 children came through our center that we organized for teenagers we also rented a special flat to work with crisis children also we work with crisis families and it covers more than 1,200 people. We also work with more than 600 children who live uh, in uh, houses, children houses. And as, uh, as we work with other people, you know, the same way once I heard about such movement when I didn't repent. So uh, through such movement, I came to God. And uh, in such a way, I started also such a direction with the help of which I was helped. And these are the children who are my followers. And also, we need many volunteers who will help us and who will have a desire to follow us. So if you are interested, you can find information in our social area. I would like also to add that you work with homeless children. You work with uh, children from crisis families, and you have uh, children's centers. You have rehabilitation center for teenagers, and you help children to recreate, to come back into their native family, you help parents to adopt children and also you help teenagers to enter the universities and also you help them to find job and church such a direction should be in all the representatives of god embassy church and we are ready to help you please call into trust line and we'll give you the whole information because you know any work which is connected with children it's a very important work it's always uh, it always needs finances. So on behalf of the children, I direct to you, uh, I address to you and I tell you that we need finances. So there are tables, there is trust line. Please help us to help children. Thank you very much. The next direction is the work against racism and discrimination. And I want to invite Kowalska Silvia. Hello, church. Our department is Jan Van. We started to work since last summer, but it is really very developing. We have 45 uh, uh, members in our, in our ministry. We work with different organizations, so we have uh, uh, we work with uh, people who are from other color of skin, uh, from different countries, but it's very comfortable to work with them. And the work of our ministry is uh, different events for students. 
and also we work with different organizations in different institutions. Uh, we also meet with the representatives from uh, gov government. And nowadays, we, have a, we do a great work uh, with, um, with different, uh, we are doing the uh, football matches and we cooperate with different organizations and we are preparing the uh, match, a football match uh, in 2012. And uh, we are planning with different uh, football teams. Uh, and we have some photos. I, I don't know, maybe they will show you. And we understand that we need to work together with the government to uh, uh, destroy this problem of uh, racism and discrimination. And there are the photos of the activities. And also, I want to invite Nova Clarissa she will present uh, uh, the social work uh, in the movement, uh, in the women's w uh, movement. Hello, dear church, dear guests. Thank you very much. We want to present you the uh, women's movement and a social organization and club, which is called uh, Was Born to Be a Woman. And the main idea of our club and our organization is to raise up the value of a woman all over the world and to become, to make her. Um, uh, important at uh, the society. There is women, there are children, and there is a family. And I want to speak about that movements where we work. It is uh, chill. It is homeless children, uh, children without families, uh, uh, and uh, we work with women. And during three months of this year, how how we were working, uh, we work through different actions and. Uh, in each region of, uh, of the city, we have a plan to reach these people. And I want to give an example. In the uh, Dniprovsk region, it's in Kiev, we reached 200 people. In Darnyska region, we uh, reached uh, 300 people. We made such a charitable uh, action. And uh, we put a memorandum we cooperate with uh, a lot of organizations and we made a charitable action uh, last uh, uh, last weekend and there were guests among them uh, they were the movement of bikers and we were doing different actions with them but uh, this time they decided to come and to see how we live and how we uh, show Jesus with our lives. And after this action, the uh, head of this organization came up to me and said that he want, they want to cooperate with us. I want to add that you work with uh, children who have cancer. And you work with different women, with ill women. She said, uh, she, she said this. And I want to say that there are women who will open clubs in different uh, cities in Kherson, Kharkov, Yalta, a city in Ukraine, Skadovsk, Cherkasy. And uh, this agreement that we are signing with uh, bikers, we agree that in each city where our clubs uh, will be, uh, these bikers will, will also join and will make different actions. Church, you can see that we don't have enough time to open all the movements. That is why we encourage you to write, to call, to join. We are ready to give you the whole information because there are a lot of movements, a lot of directions, and I want these movements to be in all the, the other churches. Thank you very much. Okay, we will finish our presentation, and I want to invite Voloshina Snezhana and Grushevenka, Yuri. Uh, we have some testimonies, and I just give you one minute, so please uh, speak shortly. Hello, dear church. My name is Snezhana. I want to thank God what he has done in my life. 13 years ago, God, has, uh, God found me, and I wanted to make a suicide, 
And in my family, there were uh, four cases of, su of uh, making a suicide. I lost my mom and my sister, but God found me and he saved me. And when we are singing the uh, song that God presented alive, for me, it's really very real because I understand that I, w I wouldn't stand here. And I thank God that he moves uh, in my life in this direction to save the same people as I was. I am a psychologist and God help, uh, helped me to uh, finish the uh, university for free. And it's a miracle, really. And now I'm a head of, an of a social organization. And I'm a psychologist. I'm a consultant. I can help people who are in crisis, who want to make a suicide, who are in such situations when they uh, lost their families, their relatives. And I just help such people. I thank God because all this uh, became possible just because 13 years ago, God found me and saved me. And Victoria, if you are here, please come up. Your testimony, please. Good evening, dear church. My name is Victoria, and I present the social organization. I was alcohol addicted, and now I am a specialist with uh, with higher higher education. And these people are the part of our team. We have an organization. Uh, and uh, we work we uh, we created a club and uh, we create the uh, uh, activities for our children we started our our club started in 2010 and what results we have 25 volunteers went through the school of volunteers to work with invalids with children who are disabled uh, we uh, went, uh, we conducted eight events. We uh, won a competition and we got two thousand dollars, uh, two thousand krivnas. We made a charitable organization. Uh, we made a charitable uh, auction. We uh, re we touched uh, one thousand children and we. Uh, we gathered more than 14,000 krivnas and we help uh, chil we uh, brought children to the seaside. We organized the different clubs and the head of the club is a pensioner and uh, now she's a student of, uh, uh, of a cultural institution and during one year we reached more than more than 2,500 2, people. And our last uh, testimony is how... Hello, my name is Yura Grushevenka, and nowadays I'm a pastor of a Christian church, New Life in New York. It is a growing church. We have our own building. We have different directions. And I want to testify that uh, the Embassy of God Church is a place where everyone can realize uh, him or herself. When I came to this church, I was a homeless. I was an alcohol addicted. Uh, and uh, I, I didn't have work. I couldn't uh, move abroad. I couldn't do anything in this country. Uh, my relatives put a cross uh, on me. Uh, my wife left me. She took uh, my child, uh, and uh, she took my child, and I was broken. But when I came to this church, Pastor Sandy told me that you'll be able to do everything you want, and I believed in this. I was in different uh, uh, ministries in our church. I was obedient, and uh, I uh, opened an organization, planted in the hands of children, and uh, we uh, were developing uh, children. I was in an Asher group. I was in a praising group. I was everywhere. When I was standing with a flag of the USA, I understood that I understood one thing that a real Christian is a person who can see the need and can solve this problem. Nowadays, thanks to a social organization, to that project that I've, I've done, God saw me that I was obedient and he put me in New York to solve there. And praise the Lord for each of you. If you are sitting here and you listen to me and you can hear me and you can hear me, then I want to say you that you will do what you want to do. You are the place where you can be realized. Thank you, Pastor Yura. 
thank you and church I want to say that Lord thanks us we don't even imagine whom we help we restore the destinies when we open our hearts and Jesus is moving through us 